everybody welcome back to my channel and today we are going to make a Dollar Tree ribbon wreath now it's super easy all you guys need is a foam wreath you can get these at the Dollar Tree um, I've been to two different stores and I, it was a hard time finding these so make sure you guys look for them right now they're really hard to find because people are making a lot of crafts with them so definitely get a foam wreath and then you guys can pick either five to six or as many different color ribbons as you want. I got all these from the Dollar Tree. We got a glitter one, we got a mistletoe, a snowflake, a green glitter, a striped, and then silver. So what I'm going to do is take all these packages off and show you guys what you need. So this is a very simple DIY depending on how much ribbon you want it could cost you between five to six to seven between five and ten bucks depending on what you guys choose so let me show you what we do next with the ribbon so what I ended up doing is I took I took another piece of cardboard now this measures six um, or f six inches so you guys want to have a piece of cardboard that measures six inches and so what I did is I unraveled the ribbon and I just just wound the ribbon around and around now it was a little bit difficult to cut so what I did is I just kept cutting them individual pieces but I did wrap it all around so what you want to do is you just start here at the top and then you're just gonna go all the way around and you want to hold that because well mine's my tape I taped my bo box so I could reuse it over and over again so you just want to just keep repeating this all the way until the roll ends and then you just need to cut one side but make sure you guys cut the side that has the one piece that's loose and if you guys do glitter it will be making a mess so just be prepared for that so what I'm gonna do is cut all these out and show you guys what to do next so after I have this wrapped I just um, you guys can cut it whatever way you want but what I do is I just unravel it once and then I just cut it right here and it doesn't matter if you don't cut a straight line or not um, we'll fix that at the very end of the wreath so I'm just gonna continue cutting all these strips and we'll see what happens so what you want to end up doing is trying to pick a design that you guys want to do um, I just picked this design right here I wanted to make sure all the colors were all mixed in with each other so what you're just going to do is simple you just take your ribbon and you just you know well you want to make sure it kind of evens out at the top and what you do is you just tie a knot and again you want to make sure it's kind of even on the top and then just tie a double knot and just keep repeating until you go all the way around so I have one ribbon left to go before I finish this now I used six ribbons and I actually used all of the printed ribbon so if you guys are interested in something like this from the Dollar Tree just keep in mind depending on how many colors you choose I chose three of the one ribbon and I chose three of the glitter ribbon I have plenty of the glitter ribbon left I got three strips of each color left of the glitter ones but the the printed ones I do not have any more of so there's that so here it is it is all finished um, this took me about about less than an hour to make um, but like I said I used up all my ribbon and I still have three strips three stri strips of the red stuff but I did use up the other stuff the one the um, the printed ribbon the tag said it was nine feet long and so I used all nine feet of that and then the glitter was 12 feet long so keep in mind if you guys do something like this you want to do at least six colors and have them at least nine feet long you guys can do more colors if you want it's all up to you so this 
DIY cost me seven dollars the six dollars for the ribbon and then the one dollar for the foam. if you guys are looking for a nice Christmas gift to give to somebody or a nice you know decoration for your house this is a super cute idea now if you want you can trim some of the um, ribbon I might just leave it there's some that are kind of loose that I might just cut up but this is a super easy thing to do um, you can use it otherwise you can also use it for if you guys have a big candle if you want to put a candle inside you guys can do something like that but I'm pretty happy if you know for seven dollars and this is a lot cheaper than some roots that you can find and it's something that you can say I made all by myself and I'm pretty excited I like the colors that I chose from um, red when you guys start thinking of things it doesn't always want to go the way you think you have it in your head but I think this actually turned out better than what I originally had planned in my head. So that was a pretty pretty good deal. So yes, this is super pretty. Really enjoyed it. $7 to make this. If you guys want to do more ribbon, then it'll cost just a little bit more. If you want to do other ribbons, other places, go for it. But if you guys enjoyed this DIY, give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Check out many more DIYs. I have a lot more Christmas DIYs coming in the next couple weeks. But I just want to say thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys all next time for another Christmas DIY. See you guys later. Bye-bye.